So of course we want to start our 2021 strong and healthy. So that's why we have to trim down. And when I say trim down, I say kalahati ng katawan ko. Bakit ako lang tinuturo mo? Ay, ito na yun. Feeling ko mananalo dito. Wala. Sasabutahin natin niya. Pakakain. Instagram account ko a few weeks back na magsisimula ko ng fitness journey and that I was going to do a lot of dim slips uh, for it. I think perfect din because alam nyo namang lahat na hindi ako masyadong magaling mag-exercise at hindi ko rin mapigilan na sarili ko kapag nakita ko ng anything sweet kasi sweet tooth ako. But then 2021 na, kaya kailangan natin gumawa ng mga bagay na out of our comfort zone to make our body stronger, to build our resistance, and also our immune system dahil bawal magkasakit. And because I do and wear many hats uh, in a day, I have to make sure that I have the strength and endurance for all of that. So, nung nagsimula ako, naisip ko, kaya ko to. Mapapanindigan ko to. Pero, sabihin ko na sa inyo, the struggle is real. It's so real, it hurts. It really hurts. Oh, ganda lang. Pero, hindi ko talaga, hirap na hirap talaga ako kasi they say everything should be in moderation. And ako pa man din, when I eat, I love food so much that sometimes I can't help myself. And also, I love, you know, resting, sleeping, kado time. So, that means less movement for me. And this time, because I'm coming on to the fitness bus, I have to make sure that I, I, have, I move a lot. And iniwasan ko din yung mga friends ko na uh, mahilig magpakain. So, kung hindi ko kayo masyado kinakausap, alam nyo na kung sino kayo, ha? <laughs> so, anyway, na-realize ko lang na Pagdating sa fitness, you should not rush your um, progress, that you should be patient with yourself and your progress, that you should be forgiving in terms of the things that you feel every day. Kasi sa totoo, it's a choice that you do every day na, okay, today I'm going to move more, or okay, today I will eat healthier, you know, I will try to be more active, and that doesn't mean you have to change a lot about your lifestyle, especially when it comes to family. So ngayon lang, mas nakikijog na ako kaya Boyan, nakikigulo na ako kaya Alonso. But at the end of the day, the choices that you make should not be just your choice. Dapat mandamay kayo ng ibang tao, lalo na pagdating sa fitness because of course you want to build a community or your friends or your circle of friends na lahat kayo fit para mas maging medyo mas madali at enjoyable para sa inyo. Medyo marami na akong na-hashtag dims dims doon. So I guess, Move on na tayo in terms of the biggest loser, medyo parang biggest loser challenge that I did. I'm doing with my team, so that's um, ABCD Productions and my glam team as well in our family. Narealize ko kasi na hindi ko kakayaning mag-isa. Pagdating sa fitness, you have to be able to do it with your family and friends. And it's nice because lalo sa mga panahon ngayon na COVID is still very much alive along with other diseases and illnesses out there, you have to make sure na kung healthy kayo, healthy din silang lahat. Kasi kung ikaw lang ang healthy at sila hindi healthy, maaaring magkasakit sila at mahawa ka pa. So just make sure that you go around that fitness journey with your family and your friends. So of course, nag-weigh in kami kasi may pa-premyo tayo. Hindi ko na lang babanggitin yung premyo. Uh, siguro extra rice. Mga tatlong extra rice sa mga mananalo. Pero, nag-weigh in kami kasama ang aking team just to be sure na ito yung progress na itatrack natin. Na ganito ang dapat ma-maintain natin. Oy, ako lang may mataba dito. Parang kulang yung timbangan sa'yo. O na nag-crack! Nag-crack po yung inimbak. Guys, tara, history to. Kaya pa! Ito nga yung winning ko for runner-up din. Uy, bakit error? Tandaan nyo ah. Tandaan nyo to. Yung katawan na to. Tandaan nyo, may sabot ako yung pangyayari to. Magpapadala kami ng pagkain sa mga kanya-kanyang bahay. As you know, saganag-sagana po ang mga nakaraang dalawang taon sa atin. At obvious na obvious naman po yan sa ating mga katawan. Kaya... Ikaw na lang gano'n. Kaya talaga. So of course we want to start our 2021 strong and healthy. So that's why we have to 
trim down. And when I say trim down, I say kalahati ng katawan. Ay, ba? Bakit ako lang tinuturo? Ay, dito na yun. Okay, sige na. Bakit siya nila? Alam mo. Ako talaga. Akala ata ng mga to, pag nag-black ka, nakakapunin na. Pili ko nga pa yan. Nakarend ko yan. So we pray for our food now. May I call on my beloved husband? Boy and Ami to lead the prayer for Team Dempos. Let's put ourselves in the presence of the Lord. Father, I ask you to pray. Lord, I'd like to uh, thank you for this wonderful uh, day, Lord, as we enter the year 2021. And as we lift up to you the food that we're about to take, bless us, O Lord. And the our gifts which you're about to receive from the body of Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Everybody is beautiful. Meaning, you go thicker, thinner, skinnier, chunkier. That's fine. As long as you are healthy, you are moving, you're active, and you love yourself. Kasi baka inisip natin minsan, fitness is all about pagpapayat. I don't agree. I think it's all about being healthy. I think it's all about being able to maintain the kind of strength and endurance that you have and you need for the things that you have to do and accomplish in a day. So, Una sa lahat, bago kayo mag-start ng fitness journey, make sure na pag tumingin kayo sa salamin, you actually love yourself. GGSS. Gandang-ganda sa sarili. Hashtag dims dims yan. Because when you don't love yourself, no matter how much weight you lose, ay wala rin bearing yan. Kasi whenever you look at yourself, you don't like yourself as much. So, please make sure that first and foremost, you learn to love yourself first. Sabihin nyo sa mga sarili nyo, pag tingin tignan nyo sa salamin ang mga sarili nyo. Ang ganda-ganda mo talaga today. Mga 1,000 times ko po sinabi sa sarili ko yan. Kaya iba yung confidence ko today. Joke. Joke lang. Hindi, hindi joke. Totoo yun. Sometimes, it takes more of me to be able to feel confident. Lalo na pagka there are certain decisions that you have to make in a day. And really, the decisions come from the smaller decisions of not eating rice, eating rice. But ako kasi, I love eating rice. I love food. I love enjoying my food, eating with my family. So para makakain ako ng gusto kong kainin, I have to move at my equivalent na fitness yun na dapat kong gawin within the day. So yun ang prinsipyo ko sa buhay. Because... You know what? It's not also healthy that you're not eating. You have to make sure that you eat healthy. So, kayo, dahil uh, you are on my social media, I am inviting you to please join me in my fitness journey. If you have tips for me, and if you have things that you do that you feel are effective for you, open na open din po kaming gawin yan. Basta kakayanin ng uh, katawan ko. And at the same time, I would love for you to share with us your stories. You can hashtag, hashtag Dips Dips Fitness 2021. I'll check on that hashtag all the time and maybe feature it in one of my vlogs for fitness para naman sabay-sabay tayong maging healthy and fit. We are actually trying a group class with Sir Edsel and Sir Lee. I love this class because it's my first time to do it and at the same time, it's so much fun. Para lang kayo nagsasayaw, para kayo nagbabox and it's a full body workout. And what I love about it is that I get to do it with the ones that I love. My kulitan, my kanchawan, at minsan nakakalimutan mo na nakapag-workout ka na pala because masaya yung time na meron. 